How does the presence or absence of foreign companies influence the economy of a nation like Russia? A question that's not just theoretical, it's happening right now, in real time, and the dynamics of it are rather complex. Following Russia's invasion of Ukraine in February 2022, a wave of protests swept across the globe. Over a thousand foreign companies announced their exit from Russia, a move that was seen as a stand against the war. But here's the twist in the tale, not all of them have left. According to a study from Yale University, 552 foreign companies remain operational in Russia. Another 502 have scaled down their operations but have kept return options open. This may seem surprising considering the political climate, but remember, business decisions are often driven by more than just ideology. The Kyiv School of Economics paints a slightly different picture, stating that 1,582 companies continue their operations in Russia with just under 300 making a full exit. So, the question arises, why the discrepancy in numbers? Well, the answer is murky at best. It's unclear how many foreign companies were operating in Russia before the war, making it difficult to compare the before and after. The Russian government hasn't made it easy for companies to leave either. Hurdles such as demanding donations to the state and selling assets at discounted prices have been thrown in the way. Yet, the companies that have stayed are contributing to Russia's wartime economy. However, this doesn't mean that the average Russian is reaping the benefits. Despite the economic growth fueled by the remaining companies, affluence remains elusive for many. In conclusion, the impact of foreign companies on Russia's economy is a mixed bag. While their presence contributes to economic growth, it doesn't necessarily translate to prosperity for the populace. The companies that have left have made a symbolic gesture, but the companies that have stayed or scaled down continue to play a significant role in the economy. This is a tale of numbers, politics, and economics, intertwined in the complex fabric of global business. The reality is that the presence or absence of foreign companies in Russia has both visible and hidden impacts on the country's economy. It's a dynamic situation, one that continues to evolve and shape the future of Russia, and indeed the world.